is up everybody I hope everyone's enjoying another new day as you guys can probably tell beautiful morning even if it is only 30 degrees this morning but let's go ahead and take on our day everywhere even in the sunlight there's still frost in the grass look at this looks almost pure white over there from my perspective at least it doesn't sound like it's frozen even though it technically there it is there it is yeah. So basically it is melting where the sun is, where the sunlight's on it. But in the darker spots where, where there's shadows, yeah, it's not going anywhere. And just like you said, Still a beautiful morning in spite of it. Well guys, I kind of had a little bit of a situation earlier. I couldn't record it until a little bit ago when I tried and then some pop-up ad came up on my phone. But I couldn't record earlier because, uh, well, I was still too, a little too ticked off. But the uh, motel manager's wife decided to come after me over a mess my family left in front of the room. Which, uh, mind you, I had no hand in it. They left a tarp, they left a flood barrier, and a broken grow light in front of the room. And yet, she came at me like it was somehow my fault. So. First thing I say to you is watch the attitude. And her, in response, she says, stop using the bad words, which I didn't use any at that point. And then she, uh, when I jumped on her about that, told my dad he needs to stop using the bad words. And when I was at the dumpster throwing stuff, throwing out that broken grow light, she put an accusation out on me to my, she basically told my dad she, that I'd used the F word, which I didn't at the time. So I had to tell him the real story of what happened. Now, I will not go by that office during the day anymore. Not unless I know that witch. And yes, I said, I said witch, guys. Just for clarification. I, I'm, I'm not going by that office until I know she's not going to come anywhere near me again. Within, and I mean like within 10 to 15 feet. By the way, in between uh, that little episode of her uh, going after my dad about it and me uh, getting back to the room telling my dad the story, she tells I basically had to kind of raise my voice and tell her it's a free country and I can say whatever I want. Which is when I used that, when I used the F word. Which, from a legal standpoint, I can say, I can say whatever I want whether it's private property or not 
they cannot control me and they don't have the right to. myself holy crap as you can see I'm walking a little bit differently honestly that's the most I've done for my uh, my forward lunges in at least a week last the last several the last four or five times I've done them I've only done about 60 each session Today, I did 80. 80 forward lunges, guys. And just like last time, 20 push ups and 15 crunches. Kind of work on my core a little bit. Hard movement in there. Yeah, for those of you who are wondering why I'm here, I wound up in a bit of an unfavorable situation. I basically had to run because I didn't know if this guy that tried to follow me was armed or not, and he was behind the motel. But he tried to follow me because I didn't know whether he was armed or not, I had to yeah, kind of ran because I don't know whether he was armed or not. So in the process of that running, I went and grabbed my knife. I'm not going to use the Sog Trident, guys, because that knife is worth some money compared to most knives. Yeah, still need to keep an eye. Now I'm so, yeah. Even though I'm not technically not supposed to be here, guys. So, uh, yeah, we need to be careful, and I need to let you guys go, because that's the only way to actually keep going. That's the the only way I can uh, turn this light off right now is if I stop recording. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 